One interesting thing, um, in the song Forever, well, the new song you were saying, uh, then, then you, well, Flames, uh, someone tells me that we can uh, run from these flames. Flames is that negative connotation. And then in Purifier, send your fire, purif purify me. Oh, uh, yeah. It's, I don't know. It's, do That's you, just using a metaphor no, but, for a different no, thing. Do you, do, you, do you think about using metaphors and then, then, or do they come just naturally? I've always taken those, you know, fire, water, symbols and 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 use them um in a variety of ways but the um yeah I, they're easy you know I mean, it's they're they're you know they're so they're so big and they're so like elemental and they they can wrap themselves around just about anything and you can you can you know contextualize them in ways that really open you wide up to 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 a lot of ideas um and so and they're big and they they lend themselves to visual so yeah i've always on that. Okay. Uh, last question. Uh, you've released seven albums now. Um, you've had a commercial peak, I think, well, uh, 10 years ago. Uh, US sales, I saw, were a bit dropping. Mm -hmm. Do they bother you? I mean, with the last album, for example, does it bother you or is it, did you say, well, well I mean, as an artist, no, because, you know, you don't make music to sell it. You just make music because it's the joy of doing it. Um, yeah, but then we, we have, of course, we have, you know, and anytime you, you, you put something out, you want it to succeed. Yeah. And, and inevitably, because of the success in the 90s, it gets measured against that. But yeah. I don't think it's something that we, we don't spend a whole lot of time thinking about it. You know, I mean, one of the beautiful things about being live and touring as much as we do is that, you know, we always feel successful. We always feel um, every time we step on stage that, you know, we're doing exactly what we want to do. We started our band. Nobody writes our music. We're, we're up here. We, we're sinking and swimming together. and and when people start singing our, you know, my words back, back to me and we start feeling that, you know, it all goes, anything that might be happening in the business or whatever just kind of goes out the window. Um, what were, what were or are the best times for the band now or maybe 10 years ago or three years ago? I would say in a lot of ways now because we, um, I think we're probably more comfortable in our own skin as they say now than we ever were. Um, probably because the pressures of, um, you know, maybe the success of the mid to late 90s have kind of, this, that spotlight has kind of, you know, take, gone away a, a lot for, you know, a good bit and we're, we're more comfortable. I think we're having more fun. What was the worst time? If you look back on it now? I think back then, I, you know, as, as successful as the, and, and wild as the mid 90s were, I think they were more difficult than I realized at the time. I think that the change in, in just the pressures um, that, uh, that came with it uh, you know, I, I rolled with it pretty well, but I think I, I would, I'm not necessarily longing for all that again in that way because it was, you know, I, I feel as a writer um, in particular that there's, there's this hermit side of me that likes to cloister myself into my little space and make the music there. And the more crazy it gets, the harder that gets to get those times. So I'm kind of split between, you know, yeah. I want to be that writer and um, so... Of course, you need some of that to keep going, but the, as much of that in the 90s, mm. leave it there. Okay. That's cool. And new album? Any new album. Any this, I, you know, we're going to, um, you know, you listen to Forever and Purifier. That's kind of, that's exactly where the band is sonically right now. I mean, that, was hap that happened a month ago. So that's really, I, I think, a pretty good indicator of where we're headed with this. Um, and I, I think it's pretty exciting. So hopefully... Um, you know, towards the latter part of next year. Okay. Well, thank you for your time. Thank you. Appreciate okay. it. Thanks. Yeah.